What's going on everyone? It's your boy Ian K back again with another one for you. This time with one of the brand new flavors over at B-Dubs, aka Buffalo Wild Wings. And I gotta say guys, we've got a very pungent situation in the aroma department. This is looking pretty awesome. Some buffalo bacon boneless wings. A lovely thing indeed, guys. This is looking and smelling pretty great. And naturally, I'm super excited to give this one a shot, guys. And of course, I'm bringing you guys along for the ride. So sit tight because up next, you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. Yeah, buddy, it's never a bad time for crispy fried chicken, guys. In any shape or form, I'm definitely down with it. And considering it's about 106 degrees as I'm filming this right now, I don't have a lot of time here before I start to burn up here in the car. So we're gonna get into this. This is looking pretty nice, a lovely situation. Let's get this going. Let me get one of these larger chunks here. Naturally, they're boneless wings, but these are more like nugs. But guys, the aroma department is a pretty banging thing. You can really get that smoky goodness with this one. And I gotta say, it's really lighting up my car beautifully. So here we go. It's the Buffalo Bacon Boneless Wings over here at B-Dubs, AKA Buffalo Wild Wings. Let's peep this out. Mmm. Buffalo flavor and heavy smoke. I'm not really getting bacon. It's just very, very smoky, but the buffalo is nice on this. I wouldn't say it's like super hot or anything. It's a little bit of a sizzle, nothing crazy. But the smokiness is on point. And as you can see with that white meat action right there, a lovely thing indeed. Let's keep going in guys, not bad. Mm. They're pretty hearty guys and considering the price point you're gonna see in the bottom left of your screen here as you're checking out these close-ups, I gotta say guys, a little bit more of a premium, but what you're getting here are six of their boneless wings, AKA nuggets, essentially their white meat chicken that's breaded up and fried to a crispy golden brown before it's thrown into a buffalo sauce that actually has notes of smoky bacon. And so apparently there's a little bit of a medium heat level with this one, but at the same time guys, it's a little bit more of the smoky side, not so much bacon, but definitely nice and it goes pretty nice with the buffalo flavor. But on the real, $12.99 for six nuggets, AKA boneless wings out the door, that's kind of crazy. So let's just keep going in. But like I said, they're hearty and I really like the flavor of the sauce. Heavy smoke flavor though. Not really getting bacon with this, but it's flavorful. And speaking of flavorful, let me grab another one of these here. So again, a nice sauced up situation there, very nice. And of course you get your choice of ranch and blue cheese, or blue ranch or blue cheese on the side, I should say. Of course I'm doing some ranch, because I think that's just a better combination here. I know blue cheese goes pretty nicely with buffalo, but still, not really my jam. Let's give their ranch a shot with this action, see if it brings it out even more. Mmm. Smoky buffalo ranch flavor. That's pretty nice. And again, the smoke is heavy. Not getting any bacon with this. It's all smoky flavor. So I see what they're trying to do with this one flavor wise, but calling it smoky bacon, bit of a stretch, but still very, very tasty. Let's go for a few more on these. Mmm. I had a feeling I was gonna actually like these boneless nugs, aka the wings, I guess. Um, a little bit better than the bone in because the price point, guys, $13, you wanna get as much as you can. So with the breading and the chicken here, instead of having any of the bones, better way to go. So let's do one more of these and then we'll wrap this with the rating coming up next. But I like this. It's just not very affordable for what it is. It's tasty though, it definitely is. So let's go for a couple more. Mm. Definitely hearty. The coating is nice. It's got a nice flavor to it. Crispy, crunchy, salty, fried, and of course with the uh, meat right there, a lovely situation. So I'm glad I gave this one a shot, regardless of the temperature outside. It's not overly hot at all in the spice department, even though it's medium heat, it's a little bit of a sizzle, nothing crazy, but I do like the overall quality of what it is. It's just crazy expensive for what it is. So let's go for one more bite. We'll wrap this one up with the rating coming up next. Hang on. Mm. Good with ranch though. But well, whatever you think these are, whether it's boneless wings or nuggets, you're definitely getting more for your money, I think, by going with the boneless version, guys, because naturally you're gonna get a little bit more of a heartier situation. And considering the price point, I think that's something to consider with this one here. The sauce is pretty nice, and overall, I like it. I just wish there was a little bit more bacon flavor, not necessarily the smoky action. I see what they're doing here, but at the same time, it's very tasty with the buffalo action. 
Well, this one's a little bit of a bust as far as I'm concerned, guys. I mean, price point notwithstanding, naturally having the bacon flavor not really being there, it's more of the smoke action. It's not a bad thing, but at the same time, I really wish it had just a little bit more of the bacon flavor. So overall, with everything you've seen and heard up to this point, I'm gonna have to give the Buffalo Bacon Boneless Wings, AKA Nugs over here at B-Dubs, Buffalo Wild Wings, just an okay seven out of 10. I mean, they're hearty, they're tasty, Definitely expensive for what they are on their own, but guys, the flavor is pretty nice. And again, your mileage may vary depending upon what you think about these as nugs or bone and wings if you decide to do that route. But at the same time, I think you're gonna get more bang for the buck if you do the boneless wing version. So I'd highly recommend you consider that if you decide to give these a go, especially at $12.99 here in Southern California. That's just a crazy price point, but still pretty tasty. All right, so do me a quick favor like always, drop those comments down below. What did you guys think of the buffalo bacon flavor over here at B-Dubs? Was it a banging situation for you? And when you gave it a shot, did you get it with the bone and wings? And more importantly, how much did you pay for it? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, it's your boy Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey guys, I'd like to take a quick moment to thank all of our YouTube channel members and Patreon supporters. Guys, thank you so very much for your monthly contribution to the channel. It's because of your direct support that the channel continues to grow and you really do help me to keep delivering the content that you want to see. I couldn't do it without you and I seriously appreciate the love and support. Thanks again for all you do and for being such a big part of our positive community here on the platform. Hey, thanks for checking out this review, guys. But just in case you didn't see the one I did before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.